it was a challenge just to get my mind around the scale of it at first. But once, once I, I sort of gained confidence with the plan, uh, the long planning time that it took probably helped with that. Uh, I realized there was nothing uh, that I didn't know how to do. I just had to be used, ready to do a lot of, of it. And uh, so the tolerances are really tight. Um, you know, we work to about a 32nd of an inch for all of our work, and, uh, but that's on a scale of 25 feet. So uh, that was quite an, an undertaking to be making big pieces of lumber with very close tolerances. Um, and then once we got to the molding phase, uh, especially these, uh, these points and the polygons, uh, they presented in interesting geometric conundrums. Um, not only the cutting of the joints, but the gluing up of those. Uh, one of the things I think people don't realize about putting furniture and cabinets together is the clamping of gluing joints is quite an art in itself. And uh, people don't, you know, there are some great pictures of, of pieces like this where uh, there's just a forest of clamps trying to push these things into place and hold them. And uh, we became quite adept at dealing with these polygons, which was quite exciting.